Hey yo, what is up guys? So today's video, I'm going over a really simple program. I'll um, be showing you guys how to boost your FPS using Process Lasso. Uh, so I'll have the download description below. So yeah, um, just go ahead and download it. It's super simple. Let's go through like the default installation. And uh, once it's downloaded, just go ahead and open it. Once you open it, you'll agree to with this program. Um, you can basically leave pretty much everything default. Um, I basically have it set so that it doesn't um, enable when I start my computer. But that's personal preference. Um, also make sure when under main, you have Pro Balance enabled. Um, everything else though, you can just leave default. Um, so yeah, it's super simple. So basically, what this program allows you to do is it allows you to set the real-time priority of programs, um, which you can basically check by going to Task, Task Manager, and Details. And basically, you can check what the real-time priority is. So for example, let's just go to, I don't know, um, Explorer, right? By default, the priority is going to be on normal, but you can obviously set it to high, and this is super useful for certain games and applications that actually uh, run better when you set it to high or for example certain applications such as like modern warfare that are set to um high by default but actually get better performance on normal you can do that through this program um in real time and it just runs in the background and it does it automatically it's super simple and super easy um so basically if you guys want to do that basically go to whatever your program name is um it could be like modern warfare whatever it is so for example for the sake of this video I'm just going to use this IPC broker for Adobe. It's basically what you do is you right click it, go to priority class, go to always, and then set it to whatever you want it to be. So for example, I would set it to high. I would just click that and it would reflect on there. So another cool thing you do through this program is setting affinities and um, which means that you can disable hyper threading using this program. Um, you can basically disable hyper threading on a per program basis instead of having to disable it in your BIOS. Um, so you can still have like your hyper threading. For example, for me, I use like Adobe program, so I need the hyper threading, so I can't disable my BIOS. But for certain games like Black Desert, or um, let's say even like Escape from Tarkov, um, those games hate hyper threading. You actually get more frames by disabling hyper threading. So I can get like best of both worlds using this program. So to disable hyper threading on a per program basis, it's really easy. Just right click a program, go to CPU affinity, go to always, and then click disable hyper threading and boom that's it that's all you have to do so once you set it like that and you have this program running in the background while you're playing your games um, it'll automatically change the process priority and to save hyper threading um, for those games that you set it to do so so i'm going to show you an example of how this works in certain games so now you guys can see um, black desert running um, on the left um, i have hyper threading enabled and default on the right you can see hyper threading disabled and with process priority set to high, you can see just how much an FPS difference you can make just by clicking two buttons. I'm literally getting a 60 to 70 frame boost in Black Desert by just simply disabling hyper threading and setting the process priority to high using process lasso. And again, this works in the other games such as Escape from Tarkov, uh, Modern Warfare, you name it. Um, and you can try it out, super simple. I highly recommend you guys try this out if you do play those types of games. So that's all I have to show you guys for today's video. Um, this helped you out at all. Um, please don't forget to drop a like, comment, subscribe. Helps the channel out a lot. Um, again, I'll have all the download links in the description below. And yeah, peace.